Hi everybody, Argofunf here, playing King's Quest VII, The Princeless Bride. So, in between videos, I went all the way back to the desert and grabbed the thing of jackalope hair, because it was not in my inventory. So, uh, yeah, I went, I, I went back and got it. What on earth is this? This is a snoring rock covered with moss. What an unusual boulder. Are you going to wake it up and, and mm. talk to it? It's got a mustache, so that's that's pretty cool. I don't know, it appears to be asleep right now, so we're not going to mess with it. It doesn't look like... Yeah, it doesn't look like we can mess with it, so let's go over here. I'm just exploring the woods right now. Oh, hey, I'm at this spot. Huh. So I'm on the other side of the bridge. I imagine once I fix the bridge, I'll have a lot more... Ooh, what's that? We've got stuff on the ground. Hmm, I'll see what going this way does. And then I'll see what going the other way does. Yeah, those hummingbirds are doing something. But I imagine I have to be on the other side of the river to get whatever the hummingbirds are dropping. Okay. So that just leads... That just leads right here. Go across here, Queen. Oh, she can't because that's in the way. Well, that'll teach me to go slogging through the mud. I'll never do that again. Hmm. I had no idea that was mud. That... <laughs> I mean, that looks like an empty river to me. It looks like an empty river. But... Apparently, I'm just totally wrong about that. Okay, so let's go down. Oh, I cannot go down here. Oh, well, then I think I've e exhausted all my possibilities. Okay, what's this? The nose. The nose of this creature can still be touched, even though the body cannot. Do we tickle the nose? What an it unusual up? boulder. Oh, 
That is a were bear. Beware the were bear. Okay. Um, can I use the jackalope fur on it? Now, t t just a moment, sir. Could I interest you in it? What an unfriendly creature. I'll never be able to get past him unless I do something drastic. Okay, we need to do something very drastic. You know, I could try blowing the horn at the creature, but I think that's it. The smash the pot on its head or use the horn. Those are my two ideas. We'll see if either of them work. Oh, my. Oh, my. It's kind of a shame we have to go, uh, I mean, watch this scene again and go on to try these things. Let's go to the first. Now, j j just a moment. Yeah, he's eating us. Okay. What an unfriend. Well, smashing the pot on his head does nothing. I doubt that blowing the horn in his face is going to do something. So let's go over here. Might as well talk to our dear friend. Maybe our dear friend has some advice on how to get rid of that monster creature. Is there nothing that can break the enchantment on you and your wife, Attis? Perhaps there is, but I know not what. Feldspar, the ancient rock spirit, might tell you. If only there was a way to awaken him. You see, I am becoming more like a natural stag with every passing hour. Thought becomes more difficult, and the shadows of the forest sing to my blood. If I find any way to help you, I will, my lord Attis. Spirit. Poor fellow. I should leave him in peace. Because I know that the rock spirit, I know where the rock spirit is, so maybe I just needed that conversation in order to trigger the ability to do something with the rock spirit. Now that I know it's a rock spirit, which will save our friend, and not just a random pile of rocks. Okay, so where were those hummingbirds? There, okay. Hmm. Those flowers smell heavenly. How am I supposed to reach them? They're way up there. Um, gosh. Yeah, I can't use my stick to reach them. Why do I still have this empty basket? Maybe that basket's gonna be good for something later on, but it's not good for anything now. spider. It's just, this is gonna take several screens of walking. Oh well. I'll just go south several times, I think. Yeah, it was the screen with the, uh... Oh yeah, and these rock crystals. I haven't gotten these. These salt crystals. Yeah, okay. Good thing I came back. I need to get salt these. Salt crystals. Too. How odd. Yep, okay. So I think all items we needed to get here from the, the first chapter, which I'm getting again. Um, yeah, the salt crystals, uh, the jackalope fur, and um, uh, well, the prickly pear, but I already used the prickly pear. I'm looking for.
this is looking like it's a wasted trip. That's okay, at least... Oh, there it is! Okay, found it, found it. Okay, and I can't zoom in on this area anymore. Okay, so the game just automatically assumes I got the uh, item there. I'll need something to do, um... I, we, I will need something to reach high up areas, I believe. Because clearly I need to get that um, super high um, flower, because that flower smells good. And I'm going to need something to reach the other super high thing in the temple. should leave him in peace. for a while, my many-legged friend. No fair! Yeah, you deserve it. Okay. We saved you, fly. There you are, pretty one. Safe and sound. I owe you my life, lady. I know I am very tiny, but if I can do you a good turn in the future, I will. a new area, I presume. Great. Good, I'm glad I solved a puzzle. But, uh, to the sleeping rocks now? Yeah, I find it interesting that's the item we use on the spider and none of the other items. Because I feel like the clay pot would have done pretty much the exact same thing, right? Just turn it upside down. What an unusual boulder. Hmm. She's thinking, but 
but that's about it. Doesn't look like there's anywhere I can interact with on the boulder. So let's try. I'm gonna try using items on it. I seek entry to your town! You may only enter this city uh, if you uh, bring me the holy one-ton tomato of Antioch. That's ridiculous! There's no such thing! Oh, and you were gonna let a little thing like that stop you? You don't deserve to be in this town. What? What? Come on, I can't get you an imaginary tomato, and what is this, a side door? And a smaller side door? Or that's just a tree. I don't know, maybe that's the mouse entrance. I'll check this side door. Stop! Don't touch that door! You can't go through there. there there's a there's a giant rabid chicken on the other side. That's it, a giant rabid chicken. I'll take my chances. Stop! You can't do that! <laughs> I just did, little fellow. Oh! The Archduke will hear of this! So it was a oh! <laughs> A rat pretending to be big and scary. Wow. Some sort of fancy animal town. Am I gonna talk to the poodle? Stop! I, Archduke Fifila Yip Yip, do order it! You are a stranger here and you have no business in the town of Falderall. Falderall? Okay. Uh, Falderall is like a fancy word for strange garbage. So, um, yeah, talking poodle, that might count as Falderall. In Please, some noble opinions. Archduke, you must let me by. I'm on an errand of great importance. Oh, that's what they all say. Then the next thing you know, they're rubbing the city blind. Archduke Yip Yap, I would never. I'm a queen. <laughs> uh oh, he's yip yapping. Oh, I have a feeling this is not going to be a, a good conversation. So he's not going to let me through this town? Mm. Oh! <laughs> I see, he won't let me through anywhere. Oh! <laughs> Darn, okay, do I have anything that will help 